Welcome to the presentation on data latches, also known as D-latches. Here is a gated data latch and logic circuit. From the truth table, we have a level trigger that anytime it is enabled, the data D will pass through to Q. When disabled, Q will be latched. Q0 will always be opposite of Q. Here's a waveform for a gated D latch. It is level triggered, so anytime a navel is high and the data in will pass to Q. This is transparent mode. When a navel goes low, it'll latch the data at Q. Here we have an example waveform with the input data and the enable. Here is the output of that D-latch input. Here is a positive edge triggered D-latch in its waveform. The triangle airhead represents a positive edge trigger. When the clock or enable goes from low to high, the data is captured and displays on Q. This is a non-transparent device because it is read only on the edge. Here's a positive edge trigger D-latch. Notice the arrow here. And the device will latch when the clock or enable goes from low to high. Here we have a negative edge trigger data latch. Notice the arrowhead pointer has a bubble representing the negative edge trigger. The negative edge is the high to low transition of the clock or the enable. Changes to the output only happen at the clock edge. Here's an example of the inputs of the negative edge trigger D latch. Notice the arrow and bubbles. Here is the output waveform of the negative edge trigger D latch. Notice the high to low transition is the only place the output changes.